Yes, we are indeed ranking porn websites. First of all, I need you guys to give me some websites because uh, I'm not super familiar with a lot of them anymore. Porn is haram, exactly. I'm a good halal boy. Um, wait, if I type Pornhub, I'm not gonna see porn, am I? Ah, I saw porn. Why would I? I'm stupid, dude. I'm stupid. Of course I would. I just wanted their logo. How do I turn on the NSFW filter? Search Pornhub logo. Thank you, Joe, for the tip. <laughs> all right, I think Pornhub, uh, you know what, Pornhub is actually F tier, because guess what? There have been a lot of allegations for Pornhub and how they have uh, circulated videos of underage girls and a lot of just shady shit. And I don't fuck with that. So Pornhub's F tier. Next, we got XNXX.com. This is one of my personal degenerate favorites. This is the most like degenerate website and it is a, a bag with the craziest shit. And you'll either find your favorite shit on here or something you really don't want to see. S tier. X videos, low key never been a big fan of X videos. It's pretty mid, so we'll put it in C tier. X and XX is fucking wild. It is like a 50-50. You roll the dice every time you go on that website. And I am a gambling man. <laughs> All right, next we got X Hamster. Uh, I think X Hamster is pretty good. I feel like on X Hamster a lot of times you could find the videos from like OnlyFans girls just like randomly posted up there. So solid, solid backup. Weird UI interface, not a huge fan of it. So you put Haname. What the fuck is Haname? Haname. Oh, this is like hentai exclusively. Oh, okay. Oh, Jesus. Um, A tier. They're really good at what they do, I guess. My free cams, anyone? This was like my favorite website as a child. Not a child, but as like a teenager. My free cams, S tier, dude. That shit was goaded. OnlyFans, fucking E tier, bro. I hate paying. I've never paid, but I hate the idea of paying for this shit. Fansly, Fansly, fucking F tier. It's the same shit as OnlyFan, but it just wasn't first to the punch. Fucking poser. The economy that came out of these websites, fuck them. You don't support paying sex workers fairly for their work? Ah, I didn't say that. I just said that I don't want to pay. Of course, I believe they should be paid fairly for their work. I don't want to pay, personally. What about a DVD box set of Game of Thrones? Oh, okay. So a DVD box set of Game of Thrones? Uh, F tier. Fuck that last season, bro. Wasting my goddamn time. Oh, Rule 30. Oh, okay, I know this website. I mean, this is actually a genius website, to be honest. I think it's a genius website. Like finding everything rule 34. That's kind of like A tier, right? You might not actually use it for porn, but the concept is genius. Oh, wait. Reddit is actually a good one. Wait. Reddit? Dude, this shit's fucking S tier. Reddit is how I start every session. You know what I mean? It's just, it's just such, it's got such a wide net. Playboy magazine? Shit's D tier, bro. Fucking ancient boomer technology. We got to move on from this. The era is over. Oh, Red Tube. Oh, you porn. Oh, my goodness. I feel like RedTube is like past its prime, but it used to be some good shit. Now it's probably in the middle of the pack because it just, it doesn't hit the same. YouPorn logo, honestly, is it me or did YouPorn have like the most amount of the annoying pop-ups out of like all of them? Like they all have the annoying pop-ups, but YouPorn is fucking obnoxious with it. But YouPorn also sometimes has the most niche shit, so we'll give it a D tier. Jerkmate? Fuck Jerkmate, honestly, because their ads just piss me off. I'm sick of seeing them. I don't think they've ever helped me with anything. Oh my God. Red gifts? <gasps> okay. Dude, red gifts? Actually S tier, fucking goaded. Honestly, red gifts and Reddit, this is this is a tandem right here. This is a partnership. This, this is the duo. This is just a legendary duo. <laughs> Newgrounds 18 plus game section. I've never been there. I'm sure that was the shit back in the day, to, day though, right? So we can give this a solid B tier. Twitter and Instagram. Okay, those are actually good ones. Uh, I think Instagram, honestly, Instagram, pretty mid. You can't see much and it's it's hard to find good stuff and you gotta scroll too much. It's not, like, Instagram's never worth the effort just to see sexy women. I actually, big fan of Twitter. Twitter's great to get like the preview content of OnlyFans girls. Twitter is goaded for their media tab on people's profiles. The media tab? Thank you. Oh, oh, we got to talk about Tumblr. We got to talk about Tumblr. Tumblr, like, I think used to be, like, popping, right? But now, they fucking ruined it. They ruined it. That shit's an F tier. Fuck Tumblr now, bro. With their porn ban. How stupid. How stupid for you to get rid of that. Pinterest got some shit too, don't it? What? Does it? Pinterest? Honestly, I've never really been on it. 
I can't, I mean, I get annoyed by the search functionality of how Pinterest works. So I'm gonna put that at a D tier for now, unless you can convince me otherwise. All right, DeviantArt, DeviantArt, not my style, but probably goaded for people into furry shit. So B tier, they know their niche and they know their niche well and they do it. You can find porn on YouTube. Yeah, but I'm sure it's like mid as fuck, right? You can like, I think I saw like, I, like one time, like years ago, I snuck on a video of a titty on YouTube. Like it wasn't even worth the effort. Too much effort, too much effort for such little payoff. Remember the try on holes? <gasps> oh, the try on holes. Well then, low key, the try on holes, pretty fucking good. We're gonna give it an upgrade, baby. <laughs> It's when girls try on clothes, like they haul their clothes, the try on hauls. It's very, very soft core. It's very subtle, but the girls who do like hauls of clothing they try on and like bikinis and stuff. And low key, one time when we were in college, we were at my house together and we spent an hour watching these videos. Just me and my boys watching porn together. It's fucking sick, dude. I'm actually not familiar with the, uh, what is it? What did you say? Pixiv? Pixiv? I'd imagine it's like DeviantArt, but a little bit worse. So let's say C tier. I don't know what the fuck Garbu is, bro. I have no idea what Garbu is, but not a big fan of their logo so so they're fucking e tier now <laughs> it's better all right if you think it's better we can put it up to b tier with deviant art i don't know how you know this many porn sites and also go looking on youtube and shit like that there are 24 hours in the day <laughs> oh i just thought of one twitch.tv slash dookie face agreed s tier baby you guys get feet you guys get ass you guys get squats and it's free and it gets past Twitch's algorithms. Oh, wait, wait. I think there are two TikToks. I think there are two TikToks. We have to talk about old TikTok and we have to talk about new TikTok, all right? Because old TikTok, that shit was bomb, dude. The people got the wildest shit out there. After it got popular and like they started censoring, fuck new TikTok, bro. That shit's F tier. But we got to delineate old TikTok. Then we got to delineate new TikTok. These are two different eras. The hottest part, the personality. Shut the fuck up, Dom, and never talk again. Well, like, why is it A tier? Dude, I remember you used to get the girls who would straight up do, you know, like the, you know, the ones where girls will do like the transitions and then they'll, they'll like be like fully clothed and kind of sexy. There's also the TikTok trends where they used to do that, but then fully naked. So the old TikTok, that's where it was fucking at. Oh, hentai heaven. I don't think I've ever used hentai heaven, but you know, I'd imagine they, they satisfy a popular niche. Probably, probably B tier put discord up there oh discord is actually a good one people do pass nudes through discord i'm not really a big fan okay you know what this is why i don't like discord actually this is why i don't like discord this is why i'm gonna put discord in e tier okay i'm gonna put discord on e tier but i get very uncomfortable when i am in a big discord and there's like an 18 plus channel and it has that bot that randomly generates a nude and you have one dude in there for like an hour straight by himself making requests of the bot and it just makes me uncomfortable because i'm like dude like why are you on this channel just go look up porn it's just uncomfortable not a fan hentai heaven is high a tier all right i'll move i'll move hentai heaven for you but this is why our discord's gonna go on e tier oh yes oh yes nataku you know what i like nataku's layout and it's just a hub for porn games you know they know who they are and they they stick true to their selves so i i, I have deep respect for nataku nataku welcome to the a tier baby hentai game site yeah i mean that's cool though rule 34 should be s to be fair it's literally porn for everything you want yeah but i think the i think it's more gimmicky than it is useful right like it's got everything but it's like do you really use it how interested are you in fucking finding tom and jerry porn i don't know depends on if you're a fan of gang and collective or not uh snapchat snapchat is low-key annoying and i'll tell you why snapchat is annoying and because of how annoying it is i'm gonna put snapchat on c tier but i also think there are two versions of snapchat I don't know about you guys, but when I'm particularly horny, I sometimes am down to go to like the Tinder girls Snapchats or girls randomly on Reddit that give their Snapchats. I'm down to add them and I'm down to explore their stories. The bad part is their stories are always blocked because they're trying to like paywall you and they're just inconsistent with posting. And I can't fuck with that. So that's a C tier for me. But I'm talking about Snapchat from the business perspective or like the porn girl perspective. However, Snapchat from the personal nudes perspective, amazing. So let's delineate between those two real quick. When you get a nude from a girl on Snapchat, bro, there's nothing more exciting. 
When I get the girls trying to sell themselves, not as fun. The only thing that belongs in S is a woman or whoever your sexual preference is. Disagreed. Humans talk too much. People you have sex with, too much effort. Porn, easy. Delicious, nutritious. Real humans, okay. Okay, real humans. We'll rate real humans. I'm gonna say that because of the effort and stuff, real humans are gonna sit between A and B tier. You know, real human stuff is fun, it's fantastic. Don't get me wrong, I do it all the time, but the, the amount of effort you have to go through, uh, not fun, not fun. Whoever your sexual preference is, so dookie. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, live leak, live leak is a good one. Low key fuck, no, high key, high key, high key fuck live leak. They piss me off. Too many commercials and too little content. But they do sometimes have some niche stuff, so we'll give them a healthy D. Steam has 10 million porn games. Steam, I mean, honestly, I don't know how to rate this one. G Steam, I don't know, man. Fucking, don't do it on Steam. Just don't. I don't know. That poisons Steam to me. I don't want it. Google Images, that's actually kind of hilarious. Google Images, I think Google gets a healthy B tier just because I think, you know, there's a time, there's a time that Google was probably dominating because it was like, the easiest way to look stuff up but they're, honestly their algorithm for that kind of shit is kind of kind of dog water so so google's gonna be c tier not a big fan of using google porn dude what the fuck is porn dude i don't think i've ever heard of porn dude okay this guy's got a fucking corny logo so guess what e tier no fuck that f tier i hate this logo porn dude porn dude is s tier you can find anything it's great for you nick sai i'll pull it up to a b tier but i'm just not convinced by this logo the the, the logo really throws me off what gets even worse is like, this is their actual logo. Like what the fuck is this dude? We'll put this, this logo goes F tier for sure. This logo because Nick uh, stood up for it can go to B tier. Yeah, so this logo F tier, this logo fine. If it's good enough, it goes to B tier. Okay, Dookie. All right, Scamp, give it to me. The final crowning achievement, R18. I'm gonna have to go to this website myself. R18, the largest Japanese adult website. Bro, they have hour-long videos for a few bucks. Not a big fan of paywalls, but they got some big titty Japanese girls, and it's not that expensive. So let's go C tier. This is it. We're done, we're done, we're done. That was it, the last one. This is it. This is the end of my porn tier list. And good night, my friends.